So I got a bunch of these little signs at the Dollar Tree and I removed the wording from this one and I'm going to work with a piece of burlap to cover this and then break this in pieces and put him on here and then we'll look at what it looks like. So for me, I'm going to find that it's easier to glue this down and then cut it rather than cut it before I glue it. So that's going to be what I do. Okay, and the little holder was on this side. And this side is all shiny white. So rather than having to like really try to get this dark, since this is dark already, I'm gonna go ahead and glue this side. It'll actually look better when I put everything together. Okay, so I broke this apart and I did that because I wanted to be able to give it a little tilt in the frame and I couldn't do it if it was all one piece. So now I can kind of angle the little guy. Um, I can mess with this a little bit and I'm going to. So I'll show you more as soon as I'm done. Okay, so in the case that you want to use this as a hanger, I've left this hanger from the ornament on and I'm feeding it through the box, then it's perfectly positioned to be hung. Otherwise you can just stand it up and put it in a frame. So there are a couple of options. By tilting it and taking it apart, I can get this down further and give it a little more space. I can leave the hook on in order to hang it if I want. So that's from the ornament and I just put it through the box. But I think that you're going to see that and I'm not really sure what I would want to cover that with. So I'm going to go ahead and just cut that off and just drop this down to where I think it should be in the box. 